The way we feed ourselves is changing for reasons of health, the environment, economy, and simple taste, Americans are choosing food that is produced regionally and with respect for the natural world. This is Outside Television's journey into the world of sustainable agriculture and local food. This is Fertile Ground. Whether we shop at a supermarket or a farmer's market, most of us expect to get our food when we pay for it. At Broad Turn Farm in Scarborough, Maine, things are a little different. That's because Broad Turn follows a community-supported agriculture model, or CSA. Customers pay up front for a season's worth of fresh produce and flowers. The farm gets an annual cash investment, and its community enjoys a very tasty return. In the whole world of farming, there's a lot of different things you can farm. How does Broad Turn fit into that? Well, the bread and butter of Broad Turn Farm, the business is a vegetable CSA. Mixed vegetables for 22 weeks and folks pre-buy their share and then each week for 22 weeks we provide them with organic food. And most families pick up at the farm and some families take advantage of our drop-off sites. We like to think of our customers as members of the farm. Since we have a, a weekly communication, direct communication with them, we can be real clear about certain things like, hey, the broccoli is not great this week, but the cabbage is, you know, you know, make up for it. And certain things that wouldn't come across easily on a retail level. It's sort of second best to having your own garden. And if people have had their own garden, usually they understand a bit more uh, what to expect. Is there an actual dollar savings? Do people actually realize the savings when they sign up for a season's worth of CSA? We like to tell them that by like October, they've essentially paid for everything that they've eaten and now they're getting the bonus. The CSA is probably a 25% cost savings over purchasing those items individually at a farmer's market or at the grocery store. CSAs began on vegetable farms, but with the success of operations like Broad Turn, the model has expanded to include foods as diverse as meat, dairy, and even grains. But no matter what the offering, the common theme is the connection between food and community. I think people think of CSAs as being vegetables, but you've got obviously something else going on here. You're actually doing a flower CSA. Right, so each week for 12 weeks, a family would purchase a flower share, and that would translate into a bouquet a week for 12 weeks. It's a commitment that we're making to the community that, that we're gonna do our very best to produce throughout the season. I think a CSA is kind of a stepping stone to a situation where the community in general is just more aware of what's going on on farms. Coming from a place where farms are over here and community was over there and there was really no connection, CSAs are in some way filling this transitional role.